Welcome. This is One Gratitude. I'm Lorraine Aguilar, and I'm so happy to have you, our live viewers, as well as any of you who are watching the recorded version of this on LinkedIn or um, uh, Instagram or YouTube. <laughs> the way this works is you can type your gratitude into the comments. I'll share my special gratitude with you for the day. I'll sing you a song, a, a classic by Del Shannon, and then I will scroll through your responses for some shout outs. To begin our mindfulness practice of gratitude in community, you're welcome to join me in a deep collective breath to come into the present moment, into our bodies, and in, into our sense of gratitude. Here, here we go. And I love the awareness that I'm not breathing alone, that there's people breathing with me, <laughs> some from uh, almost the other side of the planet. <laughs> I love that. Okay, so my gratitude for today is for Seal Beach, which is the community that I live in in California. Today is the annual Seal Beach Classic Car Show, so I'm going to walk down the street and look at a bunch of beautiful old Volkswagen buses and Carmen Diaz and old Porsches and uh, all sorts of interesting old cars, old American cars from the 1940s, 50s, even earlier. Um, so it's a fun event. It's got some old rock and roll bands. And I'm just grateful for living in Seal Beach, which has been my home for about 16 years. It's a small community where we know our neighbors, people are friendly. Um, it, it just has a small town feel for being in the heart of Los Angeles and Orange County uh, area. So I, I love it. And I love that uh, Bart Rostenberg is here from the Netherlands as one of our guests because you got to visit us uh, from the Netherlands in Seal Beach last year. So you know what I'm talking about, Bart. <laughs> so in honor of the car show, which is very much about oldies, I'm going to play an oldie for us, um, Del Shannon and the Runaways. So here we go. And by the way, fun fact, Tom Petty in his song refers to that. Me and Del were singing Little Runaway in, in one of his Tom Petty songs. Okay, so here we go. You sing along if you know the song. And as I walked along, I wondered what went wrong with our love. That was so strong And as I still walk on I think of The times we had together While our hearts were young I'm walking in the rain Tears are falling and I feel the pain Wishing you were here by me to end this misery, and I wonder, I wonder. 
<laughs> Me and Dale were singing, little runaway. Okay, let's see those beautiful gratitudes. Let's find a place to put this down. Mm -hmm. Yay, and I'm going to rotate this so I can get a little closer. Okay. Oh, so happy to see you all here. Welcome, welcome. Okay, we've got a comment from Bart Rosenberg in the Netherlands. He says, we love Seal Beach. Oh, and you know how to enjoy it, my friend. Nothing like a good old-fashioned caravan through, <laughs> through Southern California. All right. Oh, my gosh, want to welcome Danny Garcia and Taylor Padgett. Hey, Danny, so glad to have you. And sweet Taylor, Taylor says, I'm grateful for being open to asking for help when I feel overwhelmed. Oh, Taylor, as your auntie, <laughs> I'm so heartened to hear that because that's a lesson that's so important to ask for help when I feel overwhelmed. And I'm glad that as a young person, you have learned that now. Uh, I learned that way much later in life as a hard lesson to learn. So I'm glad that you know that. This is the beauty of humanity is, you know, when we ask for help, that's an act of vulnerability. It's reaching out and that takes courage. And yet that gives people an opportunity to reach back and we lift each other up. So sometimes it's easy to pretend that we're all superhumans, but we're just humans. <laughs> and that's a, it's a beautiful thing to accept and, and to help each other. So I'm really proud of you and I hope you're proud of yourself for being able to ask for help when you need it. Ah, and she says, P.S. That's a beautiful plumeria you've got there. Thank you. It's from the garden. Yay. <laughs> from Rick's Plumeria Garden. Oh, Klaas, Klaas NVC, also from the Netherlands says, I'm grateful for the classic art of clowns like Chaplin and Stan Laurel and Oliver Hardy. Or as we also have a nickname and say here, uh, and this is gonna, I'm gonna try this in a Dutch accent. De dikke en de dune. I don't know if I said that correctly. In German, dick and doof. De dikke en de, en de dun, dune. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's correct in German, but yes, yes, yes. The classic art of clowns, like the Dike and the Dune, like Stan Laurel, Oliver Hardy, and Charlie Chaplin. And I have to say, there's something really cool about, it seems like folks in Europe tend to appreciate it so well and can, can teach us in the United States some lessons about cherishing our clowns. Um, there's something about laughter, and, and for me, especially physical comedy, like the kind we see with Charlie Chaplin, um, that is so connecting with our humanity. When we can laugh at ourselves and laugh at other people <laughs> as well, there's, so, there's a lightness of heart about that. I, I think as adults, it's easy to take ourselves and everything too seriously. And sometimes laughter can help us see things clearly, but from a more detached place. So yes, yes for the classic art of clowns, like the ones you mentioned. <laughs> Bart, Bart, my fellow guitarist says, great guitar solo. Thank you, Bart. It's a challenging one for me, but it's a fun one to do. It's such a classic. And uh, he says, I'm grateful for a beautiful autumn weekend, strolling through the woods with Ingrid and the dogs. Mm, I'm just imagining autumn in the Netherlands with your beautiful wife, with your sweet doggies, and what it must be like to enjoy the person and creatures you love in a place that you love. Thank you. Oh, and Ingrid is here as well. Welcome, Ingrid. Okay, those are all the gratitudes I see. I will look one more time before signing off, but uh, I'll go ahead and start the closing blessing. As uh, however we decide to enjoy this precious day, or precious night, depending on where you are, <laughs> may this practice that we just shared fortify us and help us to stay connected to the things in life that really matter and make it easier to 
to let go and redirect our energy away from the stuff that doesn't as we do our unique parts to facilitate humanity rising during these very, very powerful times. Thank you for being part of this very special practice with me. And I just want to give a shout out to the many um, viewers of the recorded version of this. I'm grateful for all of you, and I invite you to join us live sometime on Instagram. Um, it's, I, I'm so happy to see how many people do enjoy the recorded version. And just know that you're always welcome here it, live as well. Okay, those are s still all the gratitudes that I see. So have a wonderful weekend, everyone. Thank you.